Okay, now we have explored most of the features offered in the tool, but this is just a small part of the tool. Like we have another uh, part of the tool called custom utilities. Uh, these custom utilities, like it reached now 57. Uh, now it can um, give you different services. I'm going to explore only one of them because it's 57, it's a lot uh, to show. But let me show you the capability. Like, suppose I have this is my path for the uh, resource bundle in Arabic and in English. Okay, let me add here label.test equals test. Okay. Now there is a mismatch between the English and the Arabic resource bundles. Now if I give you this file, both files, and tell you extract the difference. Of course it is very difficult uh, for you and it takes time, especially if the file is large. While using this utility, you just give me the two files and directly I'm going to run. Well, it gives you the missing label, all labels directly. So I should take this one, then open the English resource bundle and test it. Even I can test it anywhere because it doesn't matter. The order is insignificant here. Okay, let me return to the property file difference. Let me run again. Now it's giving you no differences. Uh, so they are typically uh, the same. So as you can see, like uh, utilities like this really save a lot of time. So we have built in now 57 different utilities. Also, one of the main things that we have built is an API for generating the page. Like now, whenever you have uh, to drag some master detail or whatever, uh, I can give you the example of the reference uh, screen that you have seen. We generated the list box, then whenever you change in the list box, it gives you a different table with the capabilities of inserting, updating, and deleting. So generating something like this requires an API to be built in order uh, to give you the generation options in the way that you need. So this is what we have been building like since uh, 10 years till now. So we have a very large API updated always with uh, the new components added in uh, JDeveloper. So right now you have these utilities. In these utilities, we have an API. So imagine that I want, for example, to create a table, then a graph, then whatever I need. And I have this pattern repeated in many screens. And instead of having to repeat them again and again, you can build the page once using the API that we offer and then repeat it in all pages exactly the same. Like uh, the feature of the tab page that you have seen, it was actually one of the uh, things that we have met in one of the projects. Like uh, the way the customer re uh, requested the pages is to be displayed in tabs. So this pattern was repeated in many pages. So instead of us doing uh, the same thing again and again, no, we have designed the options and used the API to generate the screen as is. So this is also the uh, one of the biggest things found in the tool. Let us summarize what we have offered. Now um, we have a utility that can be used in order to automate building uh, your screens, business rules, the overall system. Uh, and the thing is, it does this with a single click. Uh, it does this professionally. The experience of 10 years of many developers uh, who participated in building the screens and the QA team who has tested these uh, screens to make sure it's working fine so that whenever we generate it again, well, it doesn't require uh, testing, maybe just a simple check. So all these things are grouped in the tool. Experience of uh, experienced developers, experience of QA team, uh, a lot of uh, things are there in the tool. So that's why we challenge anybody 
to reach even 20% of our speed in developing the system. Uh, as you have seen, uh, like we have built a lot of utilities, um, so it is difficult for any body uh, to beat the tool even in a single feature. But as a, an overall for the system, really this tool saves a lot of uh, time, especially if you have a pattern in your screens that is repeated a lot and you have a large number of screens, really the tool saves a lot. Okay, this is uh, our tool, we we'll call it light uh, speed because it builds systems in really light speed um, relative to the uh, speed of development right now from a developer, even if he's experienced. Hope you have enjoyed these uh, videos. Uh, your suggestions are welcome via our website www.sd4it.com Smart Developer for Information Technology. Uh, and if you have any comments, please uh, submit your comments in our YouTube channel or via email. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.